And then the Star Wars weapons platform misfires, causes fires. Let's watch. Top story, Santa Barbara. 10,000 acres of wooded residential land were scorched in an instant when a laser cannon <laughs> aboard the Strategic Defense Peace Platform misfired today during routine startup tests. But this was an actual thing back in the 80s, right? This idea of Star Wars, because it was it was us versus the US, the US versus USSR. And we thought, mm -hmm. like, if they have missiles and we have missiles, what can we do? We can put a satellite up in space and shoot down their missiles with lasers before they could get to us. But I think we made an agreement, right, an international agreement that we would not do these things. We would not have Star Wars. I don't know if it was an international agreement. Was it technically too challenging? I don't remember why it got shut down. I mean, anything it, too challenging is a matter of time. That's right. So maybe it was not viable in the 80s, but maybe in the future it'll be viable. In fact, maybe in the future we would want it. For example, this laser, this laser could be super useful for colonizing a planet. So you have a mountain, like you're trying to colonize Mars and you have this mountain or, or really like rocky granular stuff, boulders. And you're like, I need a flat space so I can land my ship. I need a flat space so I can build the first colony. With these space lasers, you just melt everything down. And that's why it's a peace platform. That's it's right. doing ex it's doing remote excavation. It's not it rocks. It breaks those destroy. rocks into pieces. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it was misfired, so you know it did damage to Santa Barbara. But that's you know it's a misfire. Yeah. It's really for peace. That's right. It could never be used against our enemies. I mean, we wouldn't want it to, but then all we have to do is not point it at them. That's right. It's for peace. Also, these Pieces. newscasts just hit a little too close to home with yeah. just, is it news or is it propaganda? Is it news or am I being told a message? Like I, in the age of social media, I don't always know yeah, the I difference. Know. Yeah. So who's to say that, that that laser shot was from the US space laser and not from oh. an enemy space laser? And then, But the news, they say it's like, oh, it's a misfire. Like. Mm -hmm. So we, we, we don't have embarrassment. It was misfired by us. We're not actually, we, it's not that we right. can't defend ourselves against the enemy. Like the, right. The embarrassment of we made a mistake is much, is, is not as bad as the enemy attacked us and got away with it. Right. So who to trust? I mean, you, in this, in the Robocop universe, we're not supposed to trust the news, but it's obvious to us as the audience. But in real life, <laughs> how do I know which is which? I don't know. It's so good. Can't tell. When you're in the bubble, it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell.